Hello, my name is Ravi and I work as a solutions consultant specializing in TAV Fusion RMS located in Boston, Massachusetts. I'm thrilled to talk with you all today about our latest release, TAV Fusion RMS version 11 web access. The user interface provides the same functionality you were used to in addition to several new capabilities and continued focus on usability, performance, and efficiency. My goal for today is to go over our new features in version 11. Up on my screen, I'm logged into a demo system where I have a set of boxes that I've loaded up. And what you'll notice is our new records grid. So here I can navigate with my keyboard and I can also utilize keyboard shortcuts like copy and paste. And then as the records get updated, they're saved in part of the application. We also have new calendar tool tips as well as that auto save feature that I was just using. What I can do is I can turn auto save off for people maybe not familiar with version 11, and then you use the keyboard shortcuts again or, or update records um, with your keyboard, and it will prompt the user of any changes made to the system. So it, again, it has lots of flexibility there. Uh, we also have pagination down below, so you can get to different records fast or load, again, load large data sets. Here I'm loading about 100 records for a page. We also have enhanced reporting. So we move the reporting button from the bottom left-hand corner here of the navigation panel up to the top right. So when I load up reports, you'll notice that the same grid technology is available to you. So here I'll run this objects inventory report. You can see the grid as well. Any column header in Fusion can also be moved. So these can be sorted. I can go up here to the top left and export as well. So again, very user-friendly and a great way to sort your reports and get the data out of Fusion if needed. The other great, excellent reporting enhancement is with our dashboards. So if I navigate up here to the top, uh, you'll notice this dashboard area is brand new. This will create visuals of your records and what's going on. So here I can look at track boxes by date, so I can see certain barcode transactions and, and movement of objects. This pie chart up at the top is representing the records inside the system and the different collections. So this is you know finance, we have accounting and engineering. And then down below, I'm displaying a records grid. So these are great tools. Dashboards can be specific for each user. So they would go in and create their own charts and things, and then those would be visuals available to them within the software. The other nice new enhancement to Tab Fusion is our document vault. So if I go load up a set of documents here, let's pull up all these documents, you'll notice that these have a paperclip. So the paperclip means there's an electronic attachment. So this is just a preview of what has been scanned or dragged and dropped into Fusion. This one on the bottom does not have an attachment yet. So again, I would use a paper to digital scanner. I would drag and drop, or I could find you know, the file on my computer. But for this electronic record, I'm gonna use the document vault. So the document vault is up here as well in the tool area. So when I go into the vault, it's really a place for people maybe not as familiar with Fusion to drag and drop documents into it. So as I go, you know, here I'm going to grab a PDF, drag it into the vault. It's going to get uploaded there. So here it is, that blue one. So now it's it's a part of Fusion. It's saved in, in Fusion. I can search on it, but it's not been formally indexed yet. So I can go, what I'm going to do is go back to this grid where this record did not have an attachment, and I'm going to grab it from the vault. So here I'm going to click on the paperclip sign, attach from vault. And then I'm going to grab that record and move it. And now it's part of the part of the repository. So in this case, you know, we're applying retention. We have the metadata formally that we can search on. And then you can always view the document in the actual attachment viewer. The last area of Fusion is going to be our uh, that's greatly enhanced is, is really in terms of security. So we now use Azure uh, Active Directory. So here as I go down to admin and navigate to the bottom 
left-hand corner under security, you'll see a new Azure AD area. So this can be enabled and again, providing more security for your Fusion system and greater enhancements. So thank you so much for joining me today. Please reach out to, to us on our website or via our support group if there are any questions. And again, thank you for being a TAP Fusion partner.